If you look at their education system, yeah. they're very oriented to, towards technology. There's STEM degrees, which is what oh. uh, science, technology, engineering, and math. They're awarding 1.3 million every year, and we're we're at like 300,000. They're very much saying you you want to go to college, you've got to learn something a hard science. If you look at the leading body in China, you'll find they've been disproportionately engineers, and we don't have that in this country. But they have wait 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 their 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 government is primarily engineers. China's as opposed to lawyers. What a, what a wonderful of a poli- <laughs> And if you look at the background of most of the people that have served there. Over the past couple of decades, I think you find they're engineers. That's fascinating. And uh, that's why, in part, they were able to uh, guide the industrialization because they understood it. Mm. Well, that's a totally different mindset from most of our Western politicians. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> if you go to the best engineering programs in the U.S., you have a disproportionate number of very bright Chinese. Mm -hmm. And the shift I see coming over the next 10, 20 years is the Chinese now are establishing their own higher ed uh, in technology. And uh, they are going to create absolutely world-class engineering programs. And uh, the number of patents, I predict, that are taken uh, worldwide uh, by China is going to increase in a percent. Uh, uh, by a significant amount. Uh, I, think, I think if we don't do better with uh, educating people in engineering here and mathematics and hard science, it's, it's a long-term problem for us. I think China is already outranking both you know, U.S. and Japan, two of the largest patent com- or countries, countries that patent the most already by yeah. maybe a factor of three or four. Yeah, but part of that is mitigated by the fact that technology is changing so fast that many of our companies in Sil- Silicon Valley do not even patent anymore because yeah. by the time you go through the patent pro- process, it's already old technology. Right. So I'm not sure that innovation is so disproportionately with China, uh, but uh, the trend no, 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 line no. is there. I, I, I agree. I think perhaps a lot of those patents are just, uh, I don't know, I think of patent trolling, people who are just creating patents for the sake of patent.